Hi everyone, my name is Brian Young and I'm a librarian at Rio Hondo College. Thank you for logging into the Library Research Guide for Professor Brutlegs Sociology 102 and 116 classes. So typically, your class would usually come to the library for an in-person orientation, but since the campus and library are currently closed, I've created this guide to help you refine your research question, find scholarly resources such as ebooks and database articles, and to create ASA citations for your final presentation. Okay, let's get started. So we're currently looking at our library research guide. The guide URL is located right here. If for any reason you lose the address and can't find the guide, it is easily accessible through our homepage. What you do is go to the library homepage. Uh, the easiest way to find us is just Google Rio Hondo College Library. Or if you go to the school's uh, website at riohondo.edu, just scroll down a little bit, there is a library link on the home page of the school site. So if you click on that, it will bring you straight to us. To find your research guide, just go to the menu on the left, click Research Guides, then on the right of that page is a list of currently published guides. Uh, the guide for uh, Professor Brutleg's Sociology 102 and 116 class is available currently on the bottom. So if you click on that, it will take you straight back to the guide. So there's also some other uh, useful information I'd like to point out to you. A list of uh, library links is over here on the left. This will take you directly to the library homepage. There are some library frequently asked questions. Uh, there's a link to the library catalog where you'll find books and ebooks. Now, unfortunately, the library is closed, so you can't check out physical books, but there are a great uh, selection of ebooks available through our library catalog. We also have a link to our database page, which is your source for. Uh, scholarly articles which you will need for your sociology assignments. Scrolling down a bit uh, is information on our library hours. Again, the physical library is currently closed uh, except for the distribution of uh, Chromebooks. Um, today is March 31st, so we're still checking out Chromebooks, but that is subject to change. So I would recommend checking the library homepage for the latest information on our hours and closure. However, uh, we do plan to have a library available to serve you online uh, during our regular business hours, which are listed right here. Again, um, go ahead and check back on our homepage just to make sure uh, that this hasn't changed by the time you're uh, viewing this video, but um, we do plan on having someone online during our regular business hours to um, answer any questions that you might have. Scrolling back up a bit, as all the different ways that you can get a hold of a librarian now um, for your research help. So, in person reference is currently closed since the library is closed. Um, also, our normal library phone number, you can leave a message, but I'm not sure how often that's being checked. So the best, most efficient way to get a hold of us is uh, by email or by, uh, you can also text us questions. So here is the number to our uh, text to librarian service. You can also chat live with us. Um, the chat function is available on the library homepage. So I'll click on that link and show you how that works. You just scroll down a little bit. Uh, there are librarians available to help you during regular business hours. Right here it says chat with a librarian. You just enter your name, um, also your question, and start chat. So uh, if it's past business hours and uh, there's not a librarian online to help us, you can still enter your question and we will answer that as soon as we um, see it the next day.
Uh, you can also email me directly. Uh, that's me, and uh, this link will take you directly to uh, my email address. Uh, I've done orientations for Professor Brutlag for a couple years now, so I'm very familiar with your assignments. So if you need any help finding resources or with um, developing your research question, don't hesitate to email me. I'm more than happy to help. Scrolling down a little bit are uh, links to our social media pages. Uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter are always being updated, especially uh, this semester with all the changes happening on campus and in the library. Uh, definitely recommend following us just to keep up to date on the latest information. And uh, before I end this video, I just wanted to point out what these different tabs are and the information uh, that is contained within this guide. Uh, there's a tab for research questions. So if you're still uh, revising your research question, uh, I will have a video there that will um, give you some tips on how to uh, develop that and also how to extract uh, keywords which uh, you're going to use to uh, find the resources that you need to use as evidence in your presentation. Uh, finding books and ebooks, as well as finding articles. Uh, those pages will give you tips on finding the resources that you're going to need. And uh, cite your sources. Uh, this will give you some information on how to use the ASA style guide to um, create your citations for your presentation. Okay, uh, so that's the end of this video. Uh, for uh, any information on revising your research question or finding resources or using ASA, definitely check out the other tabs. Thank you.